now. Um, we received an email from the researchers working for Pope Francis I. The time on the email is 2.45 p.m. Rome time. The star overhead was overhead for a period of 1136 minutes. This is only found once. It is the word Gog, Revelation 28, and shall go out to deceive the nations which are in the four quarters of the earth, Gog and Magog, the Jews, to gather them together to battle, the number of whom is as the sand of the sea. Gog, Greek Dictionary, 1136, of Hebrew origin, 1463, Gog, a symbolic name for some future antichrist, Gog, and his name is Bergoglio. I received an email from Antichrist Gog. Now, he sent it to me on the Pontificate Office email, which places him in the office of Pope Benedict. It is so stupid, he actually admits he has kidnapped Pope Benedict and closed down the Pontificate Office because they all believed I was returned Lord Jesus Christ. So the idiot writes to me from the pontiff's own computer telling me what he has done. It starts out R.E. colon controllo finale per Brian Marshall. I okay, gave last communication. 2.45 p.m. Then it's got less info. Pontiff Emeritus Benedict. Then it's got in brackets the email address. Pontiff Benedict at gmail.com. Two, Brian Golightly Marshall, Yahweh at Linux.org. So, Pope Francis, one. He states precisely what he has done kidnapping a Pope and star. So, this is the English version. Hello, these are the inspectors of Pope Francis. This is an update requested by Giuseppe Sibelio when asked for any final request as a Catholic priest. The following updates are occurring at this moment. He was charged with treason. They intend to kill him. This email no longer belongs to the Pope Emeritus and will be deleted permanently after this update message is sent. Giuseppe Civellio is no longer a Catholic priest and has been relocated. Now, notice the way they say relocated. Yeah. We are not telling you where he is. Sister Maria Della Rosa is still a Catholic nun but has been moved to a convent outside of Italy. We are not saying where she is exactly. Archbishop George has sworn not to speak a word of you and is forced not to listen to what you say. Five. The new pontifical household will consist of Pope Francis, not Pope Francis I, former investigators, they are not priests and will tend to his needs, along a, then long, with only a few nuns. He will have no contact with any of you. Monsignor Giovanni Rossini is no longer a Catholic Monsignor priest and has been re relocated 
for sending in Christum crudent. We believe in Christ. We are not saying where he is. Many thanks. So, he has stated precisely what he has done, kidnapping a pope and staff. Now, I've just done it again, and I'll do it quickly in proper grammar. Hello, we are the inspectors for His Holiness Pope Francis I. This is an adequate update requested by Giuseppe Savello when asked for any final request as a Catholic priest. Sounds like he was going to be executed. The following updates are occurring at this moment. This email account no longer belongs to the Pope Emeritus and will be deleted permanently after this update message is sent. Giuseppe Savellio is no longer a Catholic priest. He has been relocated. We are not telling you where he is. Sister Maria Della Rosa is still a Catholic nun, but has been moved to a convent outside of Italy. We are not saying where she is exactly. Archbishop George has sworn not to speak a word of you and is forced not to listen to what you say. The new pontifical household will consist of Pope Francis, former investigators, should be Pope Francis the first one, former investigators, so there'll be former of his investigators from Argentina. We are not priests and will not and will tend to his needs, along with only a few nuns. He will have no contact with any of you. Monsignor Giovanni Rossini is no longer a Catholic Monsignor priest and has been relocated for sending in Christum Crudent. We are not saying where he is. Many thanks. Now it's in Italian. So we have the new computer illiterate allowing his thugs from Argentina admitting he has kidnapped Pope Benedict, his secretary, Father Giuseppe, vanished, the same for Monsignor Giovanni Rossini, no longer a Catholic Monsignor priest, Sister Maria Della Rosa sent out of the country and is forcing Bishop George to never speak about the man they all believe to be the Lord Jesus Christ, and of course, where is Pope Benedict? Today is April the 3rd, 2013, and on this date in 33 AD I was hung on a cross. Today we set our computers to observe the stars at any time. We can measure precisely the distance to any other planets or distance between them. Saturn at 8.88 astronomical units and Jupiter at 5.55 and we have Jesus Christ. Geometry. So this is the showing of that position between Jupiter and the Earth. 5.55 um, AU but Jupiter is also 88,800 miles across which is Jesus, Matthew 123, my age and 5.55 is Jesus, is Christ. Crucifixion date, there it is up close. Now, Lucifer's letter admits he arrested the pontifical household for proclaiming Jesus is back. Am I getting this through to you? Lucifer admits he has arrested the pontifical household for proclaiming Jesus is back. Over 63 years I have studied the enemies of the church. The Hebrew and Greek 1611 Bible is a weapon used to create the 36,000 denominations opposed to the Catholic faith. Get rid of them, split them up. I have taken pains to make it clear how they use their Freemason Bible against Jesus, yet proclaim Jesus, which is not anything like what Jesus is in reality myself. In the Great Pyramid and the measure of the earth, I am identified. Marriage Supper of the Lamb. Due to the recent developments in Rome, with the election of yourself, Holy uh, Pope Francis I, this is me talking to him, you are Jesuit, and the conversations I have been having with Pope Emeritus Benedict XVI 
I prepared this lengthy document for your private meeting scheduled on for Saturday, the 23rd of March 2013, is of particular importance. His Holiness Pope Benedict is well acquainted with my brief disclosures and he will walk you through it revealing the overwhelming nature of my information. You will undoubtedly require an immediate understanding of the facts and circumstances of my return. What a waste of fucking time that is. The man's a moron. He's a thug. I mean, they've got scum and bonesmen in the United States and now they've got this Lucifer character, totally illiterate, who hasn't a clue about any of this, what I'm saying. 